Here's a question from Bebo Biba or Bebo B Biba. Yeah, apologies if I haven't pronounced that properly. Um, Hi Diana, how important uh, are birthdays, solar returns? Is the date of birth a good time to set your intentions for the following year? Yes, I would say so definitely, which is why I'm always saying, you know, this is time for you to have review, um, kind of, you know, just look back over the past year and um, zoom out, kind of get the the overview and uh, see how well you've danced the dance of life over the past year and then from within yourself yes yeah, set the intention also a good time to do that is is at the time of a, of a strong eclipse say like a solar eclipse uh, as well uh, but uh, I would add to what I've just said uh, yes the day the day of birth definitely but also, you can look at, you know, the day of birth and you can see um, how, in general, that's going to, from the planetary positions, which are going to be different. The sun's going to be at the same degree, but just about everything else is likely to be in a different degree. Um, but I would add to that the place of birth. Now, this is an interesting one, especially for those of you who live away from your place of birth. Um, I mean, for most of my life, I've, I've lived out of my country of origin, which is Canada. Um, but if I was to take a an, an sort of a nine hour flight and, and get back to exactly the same place that I was born on my day of birth, that would be a very, very powerful place from which to set my intention. Transits and progressions considered, but if, if I was to do that, but we're often not in the same place that we were um, when we were born. Most of the time we're not, are we? So that would be um, a very good place. Or another thing would be to get a relocation chart done or an astrocartography uh, chart done and then go for the, 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 the line of power, Venus, Mars, Mercury, Jupiter, Neptune, not usually Saturn, but can do, um, sun, moon, uh, which which rules sort of things that you want to improve in your life. So get yourself on your Venus line if you want to be, you know, um, making more money or finding a, a really great relationship. Um, get on your Neptune line if, if you want to uh, write a, a real page t turning novel or do a great artwork or do some healing, some wonderful healing and spirituality or mystical things. Get on a uh, on a Jupiter line if you want to learn a lot. I mean, you know, astrocartography is very interesting. So, um, I, yeah, I think it is important. Thank you very much for your question.